Marshall softball will look different come this season, and not just in the coaching staff. All this week, crews have begun the resurfacing process at Dot Hicks Field, removing turf that, according to Marshall Scott Morehouse, had been there since the Dot first opened. But Morehouse says this investment extends beyond the confines of the playing field itself. We have a great complex over there. Uh, this is an upgrade uh, with, the, with the new field. Not only it's, is it the synthetic turf itself, but we're redoing the, the dirt infield, redoing the bullpens, redoing the batting cages. So it's a total resurfacing, not just the field, but everything. Softball players and coaches alike are excited to break in the new turf, but are also excited for the positive impact it could have on the program going forward. Having the ball play a little bit more consistent out there and to just make it shiny and new is really exciting. So this day and age, the kids that we're recruiting, they love new things, they care about it a lot, so it definitely should help our recruiting efforts. It's my senior year, so it's going to be fun ending it on this really nice field. And after having a successful season, it's cool to be able to be out there on it for the one last year. As for the design of the turf, fans can expect a little something different come next season. We're, we're changing it up a little bit, uh, giving it a little bit more uh, more pop or whatever you, however you want to say it. Uh, the outfield uh, synthetic grass will be striped. It's uh, it's very subtle, but uh, you'll have you'll see a color difference. In the outfield grass, uh, there is will be a large um, logo in the outfield, the Marshall, the, the Block M, uh, with the, the herd through it. And then down the first baseline and third baseline, we were putting Thundering Herd uh, down the lines there. So it's uh, more logos on the field instead of your just classic green field. The softball field is just one in a series of renovations going on around the athletic facilities this offseason. And as Morehouse says, it's another way for Marshall to give back to both the athlete and the fan base. We do all these projects and, and it's not, uh, you know, it, it's helping our student athletes, it's helping our fan base. We're doing things here in the stadium, we're going to be adding televisions in, in the concourse areas, which is enhancing it, enhancements for our fan base. Um, our, our big green donors helping them, you know, people who are really helping us. Uh, it's a way for us to, to do things to enhance our athletic program. For the latest updates, fans are encouraged to follow Herd Softball and Marshall Athletics on social media. For HerdZone.com, I'm Jay Griffith.